how to use the Hewlett-Packard 10B2 calculator to determine a project net present value given its cost, operating cash flows and a weighted average cost of capital. We will use the example on the left hand side of the screen. See the link in the description for where to find this example and much else besides on the Finance Fundamentals website. We begin as usual by clearing all registers and noticing in passing that we see the correct setting of one per year. Turning attention to the cash flows and working in units of 1000 Rand just to save on the number of keystrokes involved, we start by entering the project cost which is 1500 and changing sign to indicate that it is a project cost and then entering that into the CF subscript J key and noticing that we have CF0 flashed onto the screen briefly, reassuring us that we are correctly recording that cash flow at time zero. Now we can continue with the operating cash flows. Cash flow one is 320,000 and we enter that into the same CFJ key. The next one is 650,000 entered into cash flow two position. After that, 460,000 at cash flow three and 390,000 for cash flow four. We now finished entering the cash flows, but we need to enter the discount rate being the weighted average cost of capital of 12%, which we do by keying in 12. And we move away from the CFJ functionality back to the TVM functionality and enter that in, as the interest rate. And finally, we calculate the project net present value. To get this to agree with the solution on the left hand side, we multiply it by a thousand because we were, of course, working in units of a thousand and we see exactly the same negative net present value of 120,839 Rand rounded for the project. The project, of course, would then be rejected.